everyone i hope that you're all doing all right today welcome back to my channel and welcome if it's your first time here today's build is going to be a base game suburban home i just fancied building some at base game and i saw this picture on pinterest which i'll pop on the screen now um and i wanted to build it using base game only today's voiceover is going to be another short one i've just got back from the dentist and i'm all numbed on one side so if i sound a bit weird and my words kind of like meld into one or something that's why but i couldn't put off this video any longer i need to get it up because i've already delayed it with like other stuff going on in life and yeah i've already done for a while and i wanted to get it up before the new expansion pack came out but obviously that's not happened and i want to start building with that pack as soon as possible so i just want to get this up and get it done so yeah i, I could have waited really and it's probably going to be the worst voice i've ever done i've ever done but <laughs> I will keep it short so you don't have to listen to like my weird sounding mouth or whatever. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's a base game home. It's four bedrooms, so it's fairly big. Uh, it's got space for obviously the parents' room. Um, oh, it's a family home by the way. And I did, I did, I did a kid's bedroom or a teenager's bedroom. And then one of the one of the bedrooms was going to be another kid's room. But then I thought I'd do a toddler room instead. So you'll notice like there's a colourful bedroom that I did. Um, that ends up being the toddler's room uh, but yeah it's got space for a teenager or a child a toddler and then the fourth bedroom I did it as like a spare bedroom type thing just because it's really small um so you could have that be another bedroom if you wanted but it is very like it's a very small room so your sims would be a little bit cramped and there's not really much space to put anything other than like a bed side table and then a dresser uh, so yeah I just wanted to do that as like a spare bedroom you know to sort of I don't know like imply that you can do what you want with it sort of thing um it could be an office as well if you wanted but yeah uh, i also did a garage where i put like gym equipment and what else did i do uh like an art room an art where there's like an easel and like artist stuff um and yeah i, I really enjoyed this one it was really comforting to do i really like doing best game builds because they are a bit of a challenge but also they can be like a little bit difficult and I also did this build before we got the update to base game so I think we got like some new swatches and some other like quality of life updates I think as well now you can set sinks to be like um, a certain room type so you can set a bathroom sink to actually be used as a bathroom and the kitchen sink to be used as a kitchen sink so hopefully that stops your sims like making food eating food they're in the kitchen downstairs and then they go to wash the dishes upstairs in a bathroom um which i'm sure if you've played the sims long enough you'll have come across that annoying little little feature i suppose if you want to call it that it felt like a feature because it happened all the time but yeah um so yeah i hope you enjoyed this one i'm gonna leave you now with a bit of music i feel like i've got a lot of saliva in my mouth and i'm not because I'm so numb, I can't feel it and I don't know when to like swallow my saliva, so yeah. Uh, sorry if this is a bit too much uh, information, but that's me, so is what it is. But yeah, anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this build. If you want to download it, my gallery ID is Hutch Plays. And let me know in the comments as well if you want me to build something with the new expansion pack. What do you want me to build? I've been wanting to do an apartment building but i'm just kind of struggling with like inspiration pictures i feel like i'm gonna have to like heavily rely on some inspiration to like know what to build i was thinking of like doing like uk like council flats but i don't know I, I don't know what they look like even though i'm from the uk i don't know what they look like apart from the exterior so i think i'd struggle a little bit with the floor plan um and i want to do something a bit outside the box like I've already done a British build recently, I want to do something a bit different. So yeah, like I said, I hope that you enjoy this one. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a good rest of your day and have a good weekend and all of that. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.